Shalom Israel. Want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim Raka Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who teach and rule well at Great Millstone, and peace and salutations and peace and mercy to the prophets, the hopeful elect, and to the 144,000 and to the men and women of the 12 lost tribes of Israel, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Shalom. Back with another lesson. Um, I'll title this one, uh, A Man's Pride Shall Bring Him Low. You see? And, you know, in, in the latter days, the Lord told us, he told us this. As a matter of fact, let me, let me get that real quick. Let me get that real quick. We're going to go to, uh, what is that? Uh, what is that? Second Timothy. This is second Timothy right here. Uh, second Timothy tech, second Timothy, uh, three and we'll start at one. And it reads this snow. That in the last days, we're in the last days. You see, a thousand years to the a thousand years to the Lord is one day. A thousand years to the Lord is one day. When he came back, or Salakia, when he came and he was walking the earth, you know, those were the last days. Fast forward to now, to what two, three thousand years later, this is these are the official last days. You see, this th these are the last days, and he and he's telling you in Second Timothy on what is going to happen in these last days, how people are going to be, their character. It says, this know also that in the last days, perilous times shall come. There's some chaotic, vicious, evil, mean, mean times coming. Hurt. <laughs> it, it's some pain. It's some suffering coming. It's some suffering. It's going to be some people that, that, that suffer, man. It's going to be some people that really, I mean, and the Lord ain't, you know, it's going to get so bad. Like the Lord told you, men, you know, men are going to want to seek death, man. They're going to, they're going to want to uh, uh, kill themselves, uh, uh, <laughs> you know. And 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 and, and it, th these are the times, perilous times. It says, two for men shall be lovers of their own selves." You got all these, you got all these jakes out here running around. They're 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 they're, they're, they're lovers of their own self. You know, Jake don't, Jake's not trying to hear about this word. You know, they, when they get in trouble, they pray to the Lord. When they get in trouble, they ain't in trouble and they living freely and the money is coming and they got women and got a lavish lifestyle. Oh man, Jake is, Jake is, <laughs> Jake is good. Jake is good. A ordinary two two third Jake out in the world, you got a good you, you you got some good income from from the riches to just the average Jake. You know you can have you know these celebrities. You know they got all the status. They get uh, they get into these restaurants, these high profile restaurants. You, you know uh, for dinner and getting their friends in, and you know uh, uh, you know got boats and yachts and mansions and you know to the average jake who 
you know, uh, 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 work a nine to five, but getting paid, let's say 21 an hour, 22 an hour, 23 an hour, you know, maybe ain't got no kids or maybe just a daughter. He's single or she's single, you know, and, and, and got their own place and drive a new, a new, new car, 2000 and something, you know, got, 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 you know, maybe eight, 9,000 in the bank. Oh man, Jake is good. You know, paying their bills and providing for their kid. Or, but you know, they're not, they're not thinking about the Lord. They're not thinking about the Lord. It says, for men shall be lovers of their own selves. And that's what you see on TikTok and Facebook and Instagram, posting all these pictures of them eating shrimp, a lobster crab, you know, at the latest party, taking pictures with celebrities, you know, I mean, <laughs> you know, putting their little quotes and stuff, you know, all jewelry all out. Jake, you know, Jake is gone. Jake... <laughs> Jake loved a self, love it, you know, post it, smoking a blunt for men shall be lovers of their own selves, uh, covetous, bolsters, proud, <laughs> proud, man, whoo, that Jake get proud, Jake, <laughs> Jake make it, Jake get proud, Jake get proud, Jake will buy the bar out. Jake will buy the bar out. It's, it's never failed. Blasphemers mocking the Lord. Mocking the men of the Lord. Disobedient to parents. And it's some hard-headed little children. It's some hard-headed little Jakes, boy. It's some hard-headed disrespectful jakes and uh, 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 the other nations too you know other nation i know some other nations you know uh i don't deal with them but i know some <laughs> i know some other nations that uh, uh, they got children and you know and and, and you know they they let their children you know let them play let them play let them do what they want to children cussing you know, daughter walk around at uh, 19, 20 years old, got a cold beer or some wine and some, you know, <laughs> man, boy, oh boy. I mean, and talk crazy too. talk crazy. You know, but it's some, it's, you know, Jake, Jake is, they kids, boy, they're out of line. I went to the DMV a while ago and it was his mom, Jake mom, Judite. Judite, definitely. She had two boys and two girls. The oldest girl couldn't have been no more than 14, 15. And then uh, the the other, the boy, he was like 11, you know, somewhere around there. And then the younger kids were under 10. I don't, I'm not exactly sure, but they were under 10. And uh, uh, the youngest one was probably like about four. And he was just running around and you know, in the DM, I mean, it was jam packed in the DMV, and, and and the kids was talking crazy to the mom, like why you gotta say that to him? You know, let him do what he want to. It's too many people in here. They just everything. Uh, 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 she said something. You know, sit down. I need to do this. They have something to say. Every little time, you know, every little thing. She trying to get that little boy to sit down, but but the uh, uh, the other, you know, two, the kind of the eldest, you know, every time mom say something, they got something to say. You know. And see, the Lord got something for you. He he got the Lord got something for these kids, man. These disrespectful, de disobedient children. The Lord got something for you because there's some hard headed six, five, six, seven, eight year old children that talk back. They, they, they ain't no discipline. And a lot of them is single parent. I mean, got a, uh, raised by a single mom. Disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy. 
You know, you got a lot of people wasting food. Things don't go your way. Oh, forget it. I, I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. No, no, people that, you know, set up something for you, try to give you something and, and, and somebody didn't come or somebody said something to you and you just, I, I don't, I'm, I don't want it. I don't need it. I don't need that. And somebody that went out their way to do something for you or, you know, something that came, the Lord that blessed you with something and you just to act the way you act. Cause you, you don't, you don't, you don't feel that way. You know, unthankful, unholy. Boy, man, it's, it's death coming. It's just death. The Lord ain't, all this the Lord ain't dealing with. And this is what's going on in the last days. Like, like I was just watching uh, uh, the other day, uh, the girls, they, 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 it was three, I guess, three Judite girls, uh, 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 so-called Negro girls. You know, they go into the restaurant, order their food, they get mad because they ain't got no plastic forks. It, it, Jake just tear up the whole place. Just tear up the whole place. And then you got other Jakes filming it, you know, uh, 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 laughing and giggling. Get, get, get it. I want some, you know, just, uh, just ungrateful. You got people starving out here and you tearing up these damn restaurants. That, that's okay, because it's death coming, man. It's just death. <sighs> Three, without natural affection, truce breakers, false accusers, incontinent, incontentent, uh, fierce, uh, despisers of those that are good. You see, those that are seeking the Lord, trying to do the right thing, you know, you got, just like in this truth right now, you know, you got family and friends, they mock you and talk bad about you because you're trying to do the right thing. You know, uh, uh, those truce breakers, you got liars, you got false accusers and, and definitely going into this, in, into this, uh, to the end, you know, uh, 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 the men of the Lord, you know, the, the saints, they're, they're, they're going to get persecuted. They're definitely going to get persecuted for, for serving the Lord. You go falsely accused, falsely thrown in prison. All that's coming. All that's coming. You know, be prepared. Those that are, that are serving Yahweh, you better be prepared to be uh, 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 traded in, uh, uh, from somebody that you know for a long time or one of your fam, close fam, your sister. It could be your uncle or cousin that you didn't. You know, you done went back to back with and, and did all type of stuff. And they and they sell you out. You know, oh, it's a lot of that coming. It's a lot of that coming. But that's what's going on right now. You got people trading, you know, trying to, uh, 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 you know, shaking hands and making deals. And, you know, you got my word and go right to, to the other and go off, you know, go completely off. The Lord's not dealing with none of these people, none of them. And they walking around every day, these people, every day. They, they time is almost up. Tra we'll go four. Traitors. Traitors. Heady, high-minded, lovers of pleasure, more than lovers of God. You see, more than lovers of Yahweh. You see, and you know, this is what's going on in 2022 going into 2023. This is this this is where the world is, man. The Lord's not dealing with none of these people out here like that. And you got too many people that's been done uh uh you know that's been run all you know that's been done all type of uh tricks and trades and scandals and backstab their friends and people that's been good to them, you know. I can see if you if you you know, doing, doing thus said the Lord. And, uh, you know, you, you, you know, you seeking out the Lord because the Lord, you know, told, he told you, man, you, you got to, you, you know, you got to serve me. You got to seek to please me. So if that means cutting off everybody, you know, and just serving the Lord, that's understandable, but just these wicked deeds of, 
you know, just trying to get over and, you know, trying to build yourself up, man, the Lord is going to get you. The Lord is going to get you. Um, what was that? Um, we're going to go to Galatians 6 and 3. Galatians 6 and 3, and it reads, For if a man think himself to be something, when he is nothing, he deceiveth himself. The Lord said, For if a man think himself to be something, when he is nothing, he deceiveth himself. And see, you got a lot of jakes, two-thirds of you jakes. You, you, you think you're the, I'm just going to say it. Excuse my French. You think that you're you think that you're the shit. You know, you think that you your shit don't stink and you can't be touched. You know, you're in you're in top, some type of gang or you, you work at some high profile job. You know, you're with some franchise or corporation. You know, you, you got a lifestyle, a status, and the Lord said, For if a man think himself to be something when he is nothing, the Lord you're nothing to the Lord nothing. You see, this is why you, the Lord said you, you have to humble yourself as a child. When you come in this word, don't bring that street, you know, worldly stuff into this word. Cause the Lord, this is all about Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. The Lord don't need you. You need the Lord. You see, cause when this time come, when this time come, you're in, this, in the day of wrath, like he said, your riches can't save you. Matter of fact, let's go over to uh, let's let's go to uh, uh, what is that? What I want to go to real quick. I don't want to make this too long. You see, Jake Jake gets it twisted, man. Jake gets it all messed up. You know, the, the Lord told you, you you ain't nothing, man. You're nothing. All these kings and queens and, I mean, the Salakia, all these kings of the, king, you know, King David and uh, King Solomon, you know, the, some of the biggest kings that has, has ever walked this earth. They, the, the Lord, without the Yahweh by Shemel Shai, they're nothing, man. You know, and they, and they found that out, man. They found that out. This is about Yahweh by glorifying Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. This ain't about glorifying yourself and your worldly status. That's not going to get you into the kingdom, Jake. You play football for the uh, New York Giants or you play football for the San Francisco 49ers. The Lord don't care nothing about that. Or you play basketball for the Chicago Bulls. Don't know The Lord don't care nothing about that. He don't care. Or you didn't got trades and stocks and bonds and that you work for some type of high power corporation and you've been doing this for 30 years. Man, the Lord don't care nothing about none of that. You're going to lose that. It says uh, Proverbs 29 and 23. And it reads, a man's pride shall bring him low. But honor shall uphold the humble in spirit. Call halal yimla, Yahweh b'ishim Yahweh shai. You see, a, a, a man's pride shall bring him low. So let's go over to uh, uh, Proverbs 16 and 5. And it reads, everyone that is proud in heart is an abomination unto is an abomination to the Lord. The Lord said, everyone that is proud in heart, you're proud. You're too good to do this. You're too good to do that. You know, you, you got your status in the world and, you know, ultimately you don't want to serve the Lord. You know, I don't want to hear that right now. You're proud. You're too proud to hear the truth. <laughs> Everyone that is proud in heart is an abomination unto the Lord. Though hand joined in hand, he shall not be unpunished. You see, your pride is going to get you killed, man. The Lord is going to destroy though. And it's, and it's never failed, man. Pride. Uh, 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 living in vanity. I'm going to close out, man, because uh, I got one more. Because a lot of Jakes, this is about money to them, man. This is about money. Your money can't save you, Jake. 
And in a minute, you're going to find out that that, that that dollar bill or whatever money that you have, that's not going to deliver you. But it, but but this has been going on uh, for, you know, the Lord, he, he, he's done this to the tribes, man. You know, where is it at? Uh, you know, trying to, you know, and, and Jake tries to get the money. They want to get the bag. Jake wants to get the bag. You want to get the bag, you know, to, <laughs> I don't want to, <laughs> what it, what it, uh, Lil Wayne said it, Lil Wayne said it, <laughs> he said too much money ain't enough money, but, <laughs> you know, uh, uh, my whole point of it is that, you know, Jake, Jake has to, Jake got to keep grinding, man. Jake got to, <laughs> Jake don't got enough money <laughs> to just sit, you know. Here we go. Um, Jake got to keep, Jake got to keep, uh, Jake got to keep, uh, you know, Jake, Jake got to keep grinding. And then on top of that, Jake, uh, uh, um, Jake goes broke. You know, Jake, Jake ended up losing it all, man. You know, you got all these different things going on. And this is just through the power and the spirit of the Lord. You know, those you Jakes that are so proud, the Lord told you, we're going to go to, uh, 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 um, Haggai one and six. Since though Jake, you just want to chase the bag. You just want to, you want to get your bag. You want to get your money. Because that's what Jake represents. They represent that money and chasing that bag. It's all about having stacks and bands. You know, posting on IG and, you know, uh, Facebook and Instagram and all these different TikToks and flash and cash and jewelry. Haggai 1 and 6 and it reads... Ye have sown much and bring in little. Ye eat, but ye have not enough. See, Jake gets money, but they, they, they it ain't enough. That's why that's why I said <laughs> that little Wayne, too much money ain't enough money. I need more. Just be content, Jake. Be glad that you got your job, little money. You know, uh, 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 but the, like the Lord say, a uh, 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 gift destroyeth the heart. Ye have sown much and bring in little. Ye eat, but ye have not enough. Ye drink, but ye are not filled with drink. Ye clothe, ye, ye clothe you, but there is none warm. And he that earneth wages, earneth wages, to put it into bags with holes. You see, the Lord is poking holes in your bag, Jake. You know, and this is ultimately, you know, uh, uh, coming down to the stretch, man. You know, that, that cash ain't going to be worth nothing. But even right now, in this time, the, the, even the average Jake, even the, the high profile Jakes, you got to keep, you know, to maintain your status and to maintain your your cash, you know the last the, 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 the you got to keep grinding because the Lord is poking holes in your bag. Why Esau don't do shit and just flip, you know, keep keep earning money. You see, the average Jake got to keep you know, uh, 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 get their cash, you know, spit, you know, they might go buy a new car for the you know for them and go get uh, uh, uh buy a place and get some stuff for their kids and stuff. And then next thing you know, you know, uh, uh, uh <laughs> you're back down. Dang, my, my, my money, but right back to dang, you know, that's the Lord poking holes in your bag, man. You see, that's him poking your, poking that holes in your bags, man. You can't never get comfortable. You can't never just sit and have a nice chunky stack you know, even though Floyd Mayweather, 
You see? Floyd Mayweather, got, yeah, he got big bread. But, he, you know, he still got to spin, man. He still got to, he still has to continue to keep. And then those people that are over Mayweather, those Edomites, they, they, they didn't, <laughs> man, they, they got, Mayweather got peanuts compared to them. I'm just talking about Jake, man. See? But the Lord continues to poke holes, man. Like he said, ye, ye, ye eat, but you, you ain't had enough. Ye drink, but you're still uh, in thirst. Roughly paraphrasing it. See? Jake ain't never satisfied, man. Never. Ungrateful, proud, talk back to their parents, unholy. You're not seeking the Lord. You know, none of the, none of the Lord is going to judge all these people with that characteristic, man. He's going to, he going to do away with you in this time. But you, but, but that pride, man, Jay got pride on them. Jay got a pro, a proud demon on them, man. And that's, and that's, and, and the Lord's not dealing with that. The Lord's not dealing with that. There's some very, very proud people out here, man. You Jakes, two third Jakes, you're proud, extremely proud. You see? So, you know, um, I just wanted to touch in on that and uh, hopefully you were edified. Uh, I don't want right to come back with another lesson, but I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakakwadash. Shalom, Israel.